What's up guys and welcome back to a brand new episode on the channel. We're back on Tennis World Tour 2. This is the Moscow Cup and we are in the round of 32. So the second round of the tournament. Round 1 was supposed to be uploaded. Unfortunately, I recorded it with no audio. Didn't realize it was muted. So, can't really upload that. Um, so yeah, we won 3-1 though. We advanced. So now we get to play in the round of 32 and see how we could get on. Real bummer. Noticed it when I was about to upload the video. Actually, it happened on my other video. Basically, both videos that I recorded in one session got lost due to bad audio. One did get uploaded, which is the Love motocross 50. game. Thankfully, the tennis one I noticed in time. So we lost it. But we won the match, which brought us to this position here. We're playing... Chiobanu? Chiobanu? I don't know how to say that. Uh, the Moscow Cup, we did win last season. We earned 600 uh, out, out. ranking points. So I figured I'd play it again. It is only a three star, no, but I figured it was a win. We'll play it again, get some decent XP. Doesn't seem like a bad idea. So that's what we're doing here. Now, on to the oh. match. Up, love 30 here. I'm bummed that he serves first because he has a slow serve. And even if we win 3-0, he's still going to have to serve twice. This game is still waiting on any semblance. Wow. That looked like it bounced in. Love 40. Maybe I'm tripping. Uh, I'm still looking for any kind of semblance of an update on this game from the devs. But I really don't think they give a shit about this game anymore. Besides to drop more of... Uh, more <laughs> players and courts like... They shouldn't be dropping content to pay for when the content that's already out is so crap. Uh, they just challenged me to win 14 points in a row. I feel like the game should understand that if I were to win consecutive points, the max consecutive points I could win is 8. So it's impossible to win 14 points in a row Love 50. at any point in this match for the remainder of the match, regardless of how I went. Unless I no, yeah, there's just no way Out. for me to win 14 points in a row. So that's a silly challenge. 15 -0. One of the many things wrong with this game, as we've highlighted in episodes prior as to all the nonsense that goes on and happens. Oh, nice. But, yeah, as I was saying, it doesn't seem like they really, there's middle of January now. And there doesn't seem to be any kind of concern about uh, fixing the game. There's been no updates, no notice. Which I really wish there was because I like tennis and it's the newest tennis 40, game. 50. But hey, it's kind of like boxing. Like I feel like everybody wants a boxing game, but for whatever reason, EA just doesn't want to make it. And I feel like the Fight Night games were super, super, super successful. But there we go. 2-0 up. Now we look to break to win this match, which would be really cool. A little quick. Bit of a quick match for us, but hey. Oh, no. See, this is what I mean. Like, that That shouldn't happen. <laughs> like, I don't know why those happen. Uh oh, that's a point for him. Yeah, I can't get to that. Um, I don't know why they run at it like that. I also hate how many wooden courts there are in this game. Or like how many tournaments are on a wooden court. I don't know if that's a thing in... Uh, I don't follow the smaller ATP tournaments, so maybe they play on a lot of wooden courts. There's a shit ton of wooden court tournaments in this game. And then, like, right there, like, he had the perfect opportunity to wind up, and he just chose not to. He did the stupid slide. Like, why? Why? There's a stamina bar in the middle of the screen. <laughs> like, how broken can one... I should request a refund, even though I've put in, like, 15, 20 hours probably in this game at this point, for just how broken it is and the devs' inability to fix the game. 
Like, Out. Cyberpunk got taken off the PlayStation Store when the game was so buggy. 15. And everybody got a refund. That should happen here. I should get my money back. Because I think I've, this game was like 40 or $50. That's a lot for how busted this game was. You'd think this was like either a free-to-play, 10 max $20 game. I said I paid a lot. I think now, actually, Out. it's on sale. So you could get it at a reasonable price. Or a much lower price, but... Yeah. Shit game. Shit game. And yet I still play it. <laughs> but, here we go. So we've saved two points here. From having to play another game. Let's see if we've got one more in us. There it is. Deuce. Nice. So this guy just blew three points to win the game and force another one I feel like now we have to win the match on this game surely we don't give him a chance to keep fighting nice hit that's a miss yeah, he just started missing everything Advantage. and this is now match point alright I mean if you want this a double fault and give us the uh win that would be pretty sweet Out. we Game win set and match. we the wieners we the we the wieners there's the stats from it not really much we only had one winner wow two break points though our serve speed has been at 150 like low 150s for as long as I can remember 200 XP still 4300 XP to go until the next level so we got a long ways to go I don't think we'll get up to that level in this tournament um, there we are we got one two three four matches left if we were to win the whole thing next we we'll play Artem Antic from Russia I just accidentally hit simulate and it lost us the match Oh my goodness. That's unbelievable. What do we have here? So, well, that does it. We're going to play in the French Open next. We're ranked fifth. Oh my goodness. We lost to a guy. Let's see what Artem Antic's ranking is. That this simulation thought we should lose 3 1 in. We're probably going to be scrolling for a while. Nope, not that guy. Wow, this is really low. Russia? Nope, not him either. Not him either. Did I miss him? Maybe I missed him. Surely he wasn't this low. Nope, not that Russian. There he is, a hundred, wow, he really is that low, 182. 182. And the game simulated it and we lost to the 182nd player in the world. And we're ranked sixth. Now I'm not saying upsets don't happen in tennis, but you can't tell me that that makes sense. And on that note, we're gonna end this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, we'll see you in the next one. Please remember to rate, comment, subscribe, and peace out.